Hello and welcome, my name is Doom Knight, and today we're going to play for Resident Evil 2 Remake. So in the last episode we've got the club key here, and we've got to make our way past uh, the flaming helicopter, which means Mr. X is going to show himself again. However, it's been a few days since I've recorded this, so it's that usual issue of I don't remember I left zombies. I think I threw a grenade at these two, but they got up, like, right away. So they're probably in here somewhere. Uh, okay. They're not in here, so they're definitely waiting for me out here then. I think I turned that already though, so I think I'm good to just sort of get out. They're, they're on the floor still. There's... Oh. Where is she? I can hear her. Oh, she's going to be like around that corner, ain't she, or something. Oh, yep, yeah, there she is. That's fine, you stay there. Gotta get a green hurt. Cool. Extra heal for the trip out. You just stay facing that wall there. There we go. Don't think they can come up here, so I think it's good to run from here. Please tell me I did actually press this. Oh, I did good. Good one past him, like. Right. Yep, yeah, all good. Right, okay, so as soon as we get past the uh, big boy here, we need to head this way. Because that's our first club key door right there. Hi, buddy. Hey. It's like, I'm back. God, you're so intimidating. <laughs> Get away from me. God, okay, just leave me alone while I make my trip down here, will you? Oh, God. Don't think I left any zombies in this corridor. No, we're good, okay. Right. Huh, stop following me, can he not come in this area? Pretty sure he can. Right, did I leave anything? No, I didn't leave anything in there. There's shotgun shells from right in that room there. Do I need to grab? And I think there's a blue herb on that balcony. That's why space looking like. I could grab that stuff now, actually. Hopefully uh, he doesn't follow me up here. Um. Oh boy. Quickly grab it and go. Uh, okay, yep, so up, fine. Um, this is going to be an issue. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's what I thought. Ah, the wombo combo, jerk. Ooh, I see that swing coming. Ah, oh, damn you Mr. X, you ruin everything. Oh, uh. Oh god, thanks for letting me buy, Mr. X. That's real nice of you. Ow. Yeah, this is a problem. Uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you ain't finished me off the day, jerk. Uh. Uh, 
All right, I was wearing a grenade though. <laughs> Right, uh, let's see how we're getting out of this situation. God. It's annoying that there's no save item box in the main hall. Uh, where is the nearest one for you, Leon? Oh god, it's every route is like covered by death, basically. Oh, oh god. I'm probably gonna have to reload this, I think. Taking too much damage for a little detour. Quick, get in there. I don't think he can come in here. Come on. There you go. Please tell me he can't come in here. Okay, that's what I thought. Okay. Is the liquor in here? I don't think it is in the second scenario, so I think I'm good. Uh, oh yeah, so 6 to 11. Second portal safe. Let's go get another pouch. Let's see. Okay, so top two again. Top two, that one. That was kind of working it backwards, but it worked. <laughs> Come on, just give me like a green herb. Yeah, I literally just need a green herb. Come on. I'll take the ink ribbons. That's good. I'm not running just in case there is a liquor in here somewhere. I've just not seen him. I think he would have made himself known at this point, no. Right, that sounds like he's off in that direction. But the thing is, if he's off in that direction, he can burst through the wall. Uh, yeah, let's make some more shoddy. Okay, if I walk, he won't trigger the burst through wall. Nope. On the plus side though, that's a shortcut now. But does that help me at all? I mean, there's a zombie in the break room, but he might still be focused on that, maybe. Uh, I'm not sure what death hallway looks like. That room... There's no chance I'm going to go to this safe from here because this place is loaded with like four zombies at this point. Uh, my best bet is probably to try and go to the dark room. Uh, yeah, I think dark room might be my best bet if I'm going to try and get out of this. Poor Leon, I'm so sorry that I've made you feel so much pain. Come this way. God, I hate that Mr. X is such a more persistent thingy in Leon's side. Because i got to deal with him again when I come back to get the secret drawers and stuff. That's it, just slowly does it. Unless Mr. X comes through this door. Which he might be.
Oh god. Oh. Oh, please tell me I can get around you. Oof. Okay. Thank God he was looking in the other direction. Jeez. Right. Still not in the clear yet, though. No idea how many zombies are in this office at the moment. And also, I'm pretty sure there's a liquor in the other room now, the corridor. Uh, let's see, what do we see for... There's potential of zombie in here. Definitely liquor here-ish. The thing is, what do I have to go for if I go up? Probably a bunch, and also the longer I walk around them, the higher the chance of walking into Mr. X. So, yes, yeah, so this is what I was worried about. That's not happening. Oh, wait a minute, this is open. I forgot this is open. Yay! Now, do I actually have a heal? After all this? I think I do. No, great. <laughs> oh, boy. But, I can bring out safety items. Uh... That'll have to do. I am not saving in this state either. And that's useless at this point, unless I get a green. Right, okay. Right, got both buttons out. Uh, okay, let me think about this carefully now. Oh, hold on. Um, there you go. Right, okay. You need to get here. All oh, the goodies are lurking in there. I don't think there's any hills in there, unfortunately. Uh, don't think there's any hills in the records room either. God, is there no hills for like. Ages. Did I not pick? Oh, maybe the file. Mm. Or oh, maybe it was like a board or something. I can't remember. Um. Man, I really got to do this in danger. Yikes! This is gonna be brutal. Right, well, guess we're seeing how far we can go with this then. Gotta get this locker over here as well. What is safe? Don't wake up. I'm pretty sure you're dead. Oh. Oh, uh, well. <laughs> I should have died there. What's wrong? Too tall? Great. This is so annoying. just to reload my save at this point just spare me the uh the trouble of all this stay down there Marvin it sounded like he was on the right Mr X so if he comes through this door damn teleportation
Right. Uh, let's see. Oh, no, hang on. There you go. This is the muscle break. Yeah. But of Matilda, of course. Oh god, don't do it, Marvin. Okay. Go. Uh -oh. Okay. Man, I wish I had left one green herb lying around somewhere. Uh, where are you, Matilda? Let's bring you out and get this on you ready. Nice. Okay. Well, at least I didn't use my defense item on Marvin just then. That's good. He has still got a problem with these two zombies in the office. I don't know whatever nightmares lie past that. Oh. Marvin sounds really close. Oh, hi, Marvin. You can't come down here, can you? Apparently Marvin can't. God damn it. Yeah, god damn it. You're gonna lunge at me and kill me, ain't you? Well There you go. Great. Yeah. Best to get it over with now. <laughs> There was no chance I was getting to that uh, evidence locker room in that state anyway. Back easily back to where we were, but still got the grenade and all the heals. Cool. I haven't done the safe yet or the uh, shotgun shells and blue herb that are upstairs, but they can wait to be honest because I'll be going back that way after I do the gear stuff anyway. Right now I want to go in here, do this annoyance. <laughs> yeah, this. Hmm. I think now what I do in this situation, I'm a bit screwed. Yeah, saw that coming. Right, well, that's one down. Oh, hey, you're still a problem. There we go. Now then, most important one. There we go. Get that side pack. Uh, one o two. Nice. Two o eight. Is that all the ones on that side? Nice. Yeah, it's all the ones on this side. So I should be able to get this without aggroing this zombie. Oh, the knife. I forgot about 103. Could do for some defense items right now, that's for sure. Let's uh, equip that as well. There we go. Now then, that's just the film I think that's showing. Uh, all right, you have to get in the records room the awkward way, don't you? Ah, uh, that's annoying. Oh, oh God.
Do I have a clear path? I think I might have a clear path. Yeah, they're both hanging in there. Now I'm gonna pop a safe down. Oof. Don't like how little health I have though. I lost a lot of it in the beginning of the run, I guess. That's a thing. Uh, you go away and you. Uh, let's pop a save down just to be safe. Because uh, this corridor is not going to be fun to deal with. Here we go. Okay. Got to deal with zombies, liquors, and Mr. X. God. Why does Leon get screwed over trying to get into the records room? Clear can basically just go in there. No, oh, Leon has to get the speed key and have to go this way around. Let's see how long it takes for this to go to hell. Oh boy. And of course another zombie is just waiting to come in. Okay, now I think regardless, Mr. X is making his way here now. So, we'll be aware of that. Oh god, and the cool sob is trying to break in. How do you know where I am? Yep, there's the aggro music from Mr. X. Just get the way he left the door, liquor. Oh, no, I don't think he's coming in this time. I think he actually just doesn't care. Oof. Oh, no. Why are you like this? Oh god. Jesus Christ. Okay. Right, I need to get the gear. God. I hate that corridor as Leon. No, I'm not going to save after that, no. Well, I've got five ink ribbons. Should I use a save? I should. That corridor went a little too well. I should pop down a save just to... With how low my healing situation is, I should do it, really. Well, I've got an abundance of inks. Make use of them. Oof, boy. Man, this episode's been nothing but tense and, like, close calls. I'm in my safe room, Mr. X, go away. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Back off. Okay. Oh. Oh, poor Marvin. God, I would do the thing and lead you around, but... Oh. There's still walking zombies, I believe, in this save in the library. So that whole loop round strategy might not work on you. Well, we're committing now. I've got a save down there anyway, so let's do this. Yep. 
walking zombies that I've not even touched health wise. It's gonna be fun. Oh, there it is. And of course, it's my back as well. Dick. Why can't you just put me from the front so I can knife him? Okay. I just need green herbs. I've got so many red herbs. Oh, there you go. In my safe. Okay, well, I've got to remember that's there. Okay. Thankfully, we're safe in here. I think this is still just a big powder in the second playthrough, isn't it? This one. Yeah, just a big power there. God. Right, let's get the small one. <laughs> Been messy walking around out there. I hear you out there. Hopefully that zombie out there is in a good spot so I can grab that green herb. Because like I said, I've got so many reds in my box. I just have no greens to go with them. We already see this cutscene again. Hope I don't have to write a report on this. Is that really your issue right now, Leon? With all the crap you've just been like, you know, going through. Okay, what are we looking like out here? Well, that's what we're looking like. Hi there. That's right. There's one door in particular you can't burst through, can you? Right, now don't use this herb. Oh, hi. Right, I need to make my way down this way because it still has shotgun shells and there's the blue out there which I could get for defense boost. Uh, I guess that is technically where I'm going to need to go. Oh, I've got, I've got to go through this nightmare corridor. Ugh. Oh, he's going that way as well, I think. I mean... Oh, no, wait. He's over down that, in that corridor. Okay, so I've only got to worry about that, Zombo. Good, I thought both the zombies were down that side. I think he's gonna see me. Yeah. Okay, Mr. X has left the room, so that's good. He didn't immediately aggro me. Oh. Ah. Oh, he didn't. Eat knife, jerk. I was hoping it would stagger him. Oh, you absolute dick. Oh, you know what? Screw those shotgun shells. And screw that blue herb. It's only like three shotgun shells anyway. 
Uh. Right, I need to get this still, yeah. They get on this uh, save. Oh no. Uh, six to eleven. Damn it. Damn oversteer. There you go. Thank you. Now then. Don't like the state I'm having to deal with this in. Don't want to run out at this point, because if I do, I'm going to bring Mr. X. And I don't need Mr. X for what I'm about to go through. Please, all of you, be in favourable spots for me. I mean... No, 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 no! Oh. It was going so well until that jerk was right there. Ah, oh, damn it! Right, first you back to where we are. I actually brought a red herb out with me this time, so I'm going to combine with that green because you know that's smart. And I've still got the heel and the knife, and I picked up the shotgun shells. So overall, better shape than it was before. However, I think Mr. X is on me, and I didn't get the waiting room safe. Please don't be right here, Mr. X. Okay. Oof. Okay, I've put this in like three times now. This death muzzle break will be mine. Assuming that Mr. X doesn't be a pain, I should be able to get through... Oh. Well, speaking of which... I saw that shadow and I was like, oh, damn. Well, you know what? That's fine. It gives me a reason to go back here and put a safe down. Man, I think I've saved for you the most in this episode. I have in any episode. Within like the smallest gap, that is. Right. Okay. Also, this gives me time to bring up the right items. I guess save me going to the other save room. Right. So I need that. Don't need that. Bring out Matilda. There you go. Empower Matilda. Pop you away. Pop you away as well. Uh, give me an ink. Yeah, I've still got enough inks. It's good. There we go. Okay. I feel a lot more safer about doing this corridor now. Thank God. Hopefully I get the same uh, layout as zombies that I did last time. That'd be nice. Oh. Look who's guarding the staircase. Hmm. I was referring to Marvin, Mr. X, but sure, you can guard it as well. And I really don't want Mr. X following me for this bit. So 
I don't want to be running too much. Until that zombie burst through the window, that is. Right, maybe I should walk from now then. Though he stops tracking me. Right. Okay, Elliot's still in the same spot, that's good. Good sign. So are these guys, good. Keep walking for now. Yep, this room is definitely a death corridor now. Okay, now it's got to deal with the dogs. I don't think they've despawned. Have they despawned? No. Just around this corridor, right? Yeah, about to say. Oh. Hmm. Well, this confrontation seems inevitable. Hey, there we go. Nice. Oh, yeah. What dog? Went through the door then? Right, you should be dead, right? I think I, I killed you. Just give you a one for good measure. There we go. Oh, shut up. Right, well, it took a while, but we're here. Oh, yeah, I see it. There you go. Too focused on the bot bits. <laughs> Wasn't paying attention to what was above. Right. Uh, note. Ben's memo. The station's swarming with monsters. Even here I can hear their cries. But it's not the zombies I'm afraid of. Codenamed Tyrant. The ultimate bioweapon. Developed by those bastards in the utmost secrecy. To think that that thing might be wandering around here. Chances are they've ordered it to wipe out the witnesses. Yep. Pretty much summarising the whole Mr. X law right there on note. And uh, thanks for a heal, for God's sake. Uh, huh? yeah, that doesn't explain the rumours about the orphanage. I, I just find it way too coincidental Umbrella is one of the benefactors. You told me this interview is about the new scholarship umbrella setup. <laughs> Come on, Lynette. Nobody cares about that. They want to know about the G virus. Where did you hear about this? They had a big fucking sinkhole in the city, which, by the way, rumor has it goes straight to your underground lab. Now, are yeah. you going to talk to me? Or are you going to. This interview is over. <laughs> Bitch. Not looking so good there, Ben. Right. What are they after? Let's see how well this goes then. That's not good. Oh, you mad? Give me a break. Oh, 
Yikes, that was close. Uh-oh. Yep, that's fine. Just take that. Keep it. I ain't going for seconds. Hi there, big guy. <laughs> Mr. X like, oh shit. <laughs> Twice. I didn't realize you were keeping score. Look, this isn't a game. Oh, you gotta kill me. Nothing dies down here. Well said, Ada. I take it you have the key card. Yeah. And this. I was hoping you could explain what's on it. Maybe. After I hear it. Let's get out of here. Man, why'd you be so cool, Ada? Yeah, let's get out of this place, finally. Jesus. It took way too long. <laughs> After you, Ada. Seems though you can know how to crouch. Oh hey, healing, finally. the intel you needed? Unfortunately, no. Ben didn't come through. Well, what exactly are you looking for? More info on the people responsible for this mess. What about you? Trying to save the world? Yeah, well, someone's got to get word to the authorities. We need reinforcements to save this city. The city's gone, Leon. You ain't reinforcing nothing, nothing here. Also, I love how Ada just states the obvious right here. Roads out. No. Going through that gun shop looks like the only way. You think? Gonna see Kendo. Give me some supplies. Shotgun upgrade. I think this is what makes the shotgun actually good. From right, that one. Hey, defense item. Oh yeah, this is Jill's letter in it. The one that she doesn't actually write in uh, the Resident Evil 3 remake. Letter to the shopkeeper. Kendo, it seems like you've got your reasons for staying put, so I'll trust you to take care of yourself. Still, if things get worse and your other arrangements don't work out, you know where to find me. I'll do everything I can. Jill Valentine. It would have been nice to have seen her write that note, just saying. Uh, okay. Don't move. I'm not gonna hurt you. I said don't move! I'm just passing through. I'm gonna ask you to lower that weapon. I kill you are. You gotta turn around and go right back out the way you came in. That's not creepy at all. I think your daughter needs help, sir. Don't tell me. How to deal with my daughter. Drop it. No! Wait! Step aside. We need to terminate her before she turns. Terminate? It's my fucking daughter. Ada. Just let them be. Emma? Sweetheart, I told you to stay put. Daddy. Yeah, daddy's here. Okay. Those fucking things outside. Look what 
what they did to us. You're a cop. You're supposed to know something. How did this happen? Huh? She was a sweet little angel. Mommy. I'm sleeping, honey. Okay. And I'm gonna put you to bed too, okay? Emma. Just go. Just give us some privacy. You know, it's one thing to keep the truth from me, but why him? I want to find out what's happening here and stop whoever's behind it. Helping people like them? That's why I joined the force. My mission is to take down Umbrella's entire operation. We may not make it out. Whatever it takes to save this city, count me in. I always thought he shot Emma. But if you go to Ghost Fives, it's he like shoots himself. Which is sad. I like that. I like the. I, I like and don't like what they do Kendo in this game. I like it because it's like, oh, the human element of the outbreak showing like what the, the normal people were going through. And like the uh, the insides of it all. But I kind of like how Kendo is in the original. He's just this creepy gun shop owner. He's so funny. Alright. Heard of the Umbrella Corporation? They're a pharmaceutical company secretly making bioweapons. They have a virus. It turns people into indestructible monsters. That explains the horrible things I've seen. It was like appropriate timing to have the giant umbrella poster there. And that's why I'm looking for Annette Birkin. She's the one at Umbrella responsible for unleashing the virus. I'm going to bring her down. I like how she kind of cuts herself off there. So she barely gets the word virus out. She like doesn't even get like the S bit out. And then she's already saying her next sentence. It's like, take a breath, Ada. And like, you know, continue your next sentence after that. Jesus, calm down. <laughs> this is how we get to Annette. Based on what you've said, the sewer seems fitting. Well said. After you. Gee, thanks. Yeah, thanks, Ada. Jesus. Yeah. Back to your old stinky can't sewer. A real scientist being down here. According to HQ, this leads right into Umbrella's secret facility. Come on, sewers are run by the city. How could they have a facility without the authorities knowing? Welcome to corporate America. Umbrella's controlled Raccoon City for years. Yep. Jesus! That an earthquake? I sure as hell hope so. Yep, there you go. I thought there was something somewhere. Hey, big boy. What the hell? Yeah. Right, okay. Shotgun, where are you? Uh, there you are. Nice. Two slots, but that's whatever. Uh, store you away. Uh, yeah, I suppose I should keep that on me, because I ain't got any other defense items. However, I can use up one of these damn herbs. There we go. Right, I'm going to pop a save down here, because even though this episode isn't going to be... Well, this episode still be so long, I think, but I've been recording this for a while to make up for all the uh, deaths. So this is a good place for me to stop this right now, otherwise this video will never go out on time. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like and a comment. If you haven't already, want to slap the subscribe button. It's totally free and helps the channel grow. It's Jim Mayanita. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Have a nice day.